Hi everyone, I'm Curtis with Customer Success here at Ubersuggest, and today I'm going to teach you how to find profitable keywords using Ubersuggest. So choosing the right keywords will enable you to develop well-optimized pages and compelling content that will attract customers who will convert on your site. So before you get started, uh, let's make sure that you've already created a project within Ubersuggest so that way you can track your SEO progress, more specifically in this example, track your SEO keywords. So let's hop into the keyword analyzer report and go to keyword overview. Now, I want you to think about a keyword that you really wanna rank for and make sure that it's related specifically to your business, the services you offer or the products you sell. So in this case, I'm gonna type in marketing. Now the keyword overview is going to give me a general idea of the monthly search volume for a specific term, the SEO difficulty, which is on a scale from zero to 100 with 100 being more difficult to rank for the paid difficulty, which gives me an indicator of how competitive a keyword is being bidded upon within Google AdWords and the cost per click. You can also break down the keyword by country, state or region. Uh, so for this instance, let's just keep it within the United States. Going down further, you'll see the search volume broken down uh, by mobile and desktop volume. And you can also see seasonality trends here as well. You can see the amount of people who click on organic search results versus paid results versus no results at all. And you can even see a breakdown of age demographics, which is very useful too. So getting into the keyword ideas report, where you can get additional keywords in regards to marketing and find those keywords that'll really help drive you traffic that converts, you can take a look at the suggestions, related questions, prepositions, and comparisons. So when you're looking at keywords to target, there are a few indicators that will give you an idea of which ones will perform. First, you're probably gonna wanna target the longer tail keywords, which are three to four phrases, uh, rather than the one or two phrase keywords, because those typically have more buyer intent and are more specific. So for example, marketing strategy template. If someone was looking specifically for a marketing strategy or were looking to outsource a marketing strategy, this would be a good keyword to start utilizing to dry and use as a lead converter. So it has a significant search volume. It has a relatively easy search difficulty under 40, and it has a pretty high cost per click. So if you're looking at cost per click and it's a relatively high amount, that means that advertisers are bidding for that keyword and it's likely driving them conversions to their website. So those are a few factors that you want to look out for. To recap, a significant search volume, a higher cost per click, and a relatively easy search difficulty to start out with. Now you can start checking off these particular keywords that are specific to your business. And I'm just going at random here. You can take these and export them to CSV or copy to clipboard. Let's go back into your dashboard. and add these to your tracked keywords. Go into here, click Add Keywords, and click Start Tracking. That'll now be added to my project, and I can keep track of that keyword. So as you come up with additional keyword ideas on what you may want to target, you can continually repeat this process. If you want more specific guidance on how to do keyword research, check out our SEO Unlock series. If you have any specific questions, please feel free to reach out to our support team at support at ubersuggest.com.